Welcome back to the channel. Today we are opening up first box of 2122 Upper Deck Extended Series. Going to see what that's all about and talk about it. But first, as is my gimmick, going to pull a card from my PC and talk about why I love it. And this one, it's uh, themed to the box because it's the first time we're opening a product that has the potential to have some cards from one of my PCs, Greg Pattern. So I brought out the Panini Dominion Gold Rookie Auto. This is from 1314 Panini Dominion. High-end set that obviously only lasted for a couple of, maybe just one year even, because Panini didn't have the NHL license for very long. But this is the only hard-signed auto that exists of Greg Pattern in an official licensed product. So, decided to pull it out because we're looking for Greg Pattern base cards in here for some reason. I don't know. Ask Upper Deck. Doesn't make sense to me. Why also we're not looking for any Timothy Lilligrens? Oh, beyond me. But let's talk about Extended. Specifically, let's talk about Extended from last year. Because it was not good. As of recording, the best young gun from Extended last year. And there were only 25, not 50, as is any usual flagship release, is Michael Bunting. And he's like a 15 to 20 dollar young gun, depending on the day. And I love Michael Bunting. But if that's the best young gun you can get in a crop, oof. That's tough. Now, this one is theoretically better. There are 50 young guns, as opposed to 25. But not really any of the enormous names. Uh, some good ones. Seth Jarvis is a big one that people are excited about. Alex Turkmott's a good one. Uh, there's some other ones that I'm not just going to pretend. And there is the Moritz Sire Canvas Young Gun. So it's better. And you'll mention I said a canvas young gun, because there are canvas. There were no canvas in Extended Series last year. There are retro young guns, just like there was, but it was 0506 last year, which is an iconic design. This year is 0607, which is not exactly what I would call iconic. But you know what? I'm not going to prejudge the product. Still going to go for it. Let's see what we can do. I wasn't going to open it. I wasn't, because I felt the potential was so low. But I'm still going to go for it, because it's got better potential than last year's does. And it's a clear cut right off the bat. All right, well, that's fun. Uh, it's got better potential than last year's does. And I don't know, it's always fun. The thing that I, I really wish Extended had done better is that the they had all these different fun, weird inserts. And I really wish that the product had been better in there. So there's a young gun as well. So it's starting off hot. Uh, like I, I love opening it because it's fun and different and you, know, you get all kinds of interesting stuff, which... Like, that's what I love about opening series two, right? It's the it's the weird, quirky inserts. Okay, so this is, I think, a black diamond. So, let's start. Jaden Schwartz. Peter Morazic. Sure. Alex Carrier. It is a black diamond. And it's a rookie gems single diamond of Vasily Podkolzin. These are cool. This is one, because this is, I believe, retro to 06, 07. That, eh, maybe it's 05, 06, but that's a, that's a cool set. I miss the old Black Diamond. The new Black Diamond doesn't do it for me. Strawman, Kane, Ranta, and Sanford. So that is a single diamond. You can see there, there are up to quad diamonds. That's a pretty good single diamond to get in my opinion. Let's see here. <laughs> we got the other Black Diamond. There's two Black Diamonds per, per box. Montembeau. Butcher, Hunt, and a single diamond of Nikita Kucherov. So two single diamonds for me. Cogliano, Rowney, Dylan, and Joseph. So we're looking for the Greg Pattern base card. And obviously we would be blessed to get an exclusive or a high gloss. But not counting on that. Okay, so this is a canvas. But the canvases have something extra to look for this year because there are mascot canvases, and whole oh, baby, do I want the gritty one? Graves, Voracek, Vladar, and a Connor McMichael canvas. Tatar, Rask, Caleb Jones, and Zach Parise. They're hard to hit. They're like retired canvas level one in ninety-six, I think. But we can dream. Uh, that is a. Red looking canvas, so that's a canvas young gun. I think that's a it's a horizontal too. Scyther is a vertical, sadly, so that's not him. But hey, we've already got a clear cut 
and a canvas young gun, I think. So we're off to a good start. Regular canvas, it looks like. Brassois, Yanmar, Johansson, Letty, and a canvas of Andreas Janssen. A Makar All Star? That's confusing. I guess. NHL All Star First Team. Karak Dodonov. I'm going to keep an eye on that, I guess. I might have to go back. I'm not sure what I was looking at. Is that just a part of the base set? It's got to be just a part of the base set, right? I think this is a portrait. Uh, Camp, Cunning, Flurry. Yeah, there we go. See, you can just see that says uh, second team All Star. Oh, it's a checklist. Dodoy. Camp, Bogosian, Coleman, and Dano. Really, eh? Nothing. A base pack. Whoa, 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 extended. I'm very disappointed in you. Moving on. Boy, those first second all-star tinkers were weird. Just a headshot and a little thing denoting. All right, all right okay. Uh, canvas here. OEL, Wedgwood, Helm, Kulikov, and a Jonathan Taves canvas. That's a great photo. Giordano, inaugural game, cool. Broussard and Rantanen, so yes, definitely just nothing. A base pack, really extended. I didn't miss anything there. I don't know. Ooh, these are sticky. Just trying to unstick them so I can see what's in there. Ooh, it's something shiny. That's probably why it was sticky. Appleton. Perry, Nate Schmidt, and an SPX Retro of Kale McCarr. I believe those are one per box. Felino, Dickinson, Nemeth, and Hag. Boy, you really see like the bottoms of teams' rosters in these in extent, which is kind of cool. Like genuinely, this is the... I'm talking about finding Greg Pattern, right? Like, where, where else are you going to get Greg Pattern? I know that like top baseball does every player in the major leagues, it feels like. And I suppose basketball does too, but obviously smaller uh, subset of players to work with. But I don't know, it's just cool. All right. No idea what we got going on here. Forbart, Gulman, Buckwist. Oh, there's a first retro of Leon Dreisaitl. 0607, not my favorite design. Sad, Montour, Chara, and Rodriguez. It's just, it's bland. 506 is so cool. Like, such an amazing, interesting, different-looking set. I know 607 is just... Like, the base card is fine, but the young gun is so boring. And theoretically, you should be seeing one in this box, but we'll find out. There's another young gun. So we're up to three of our six. And once again, if we see seven, seven equals good. What have we got here? Looks like another retro. Atkinson, Pitlick, Raffle, Reeves, and an Evgeny Malkin retro. That was his rookie year, of course. Huberto, Alexiak, and Hathaway. Yeah, I mean, the base design's fine. It's just... Yeah, whatever. I'll, I'll keep my complaints to myself. Uh, we've got another young gun here. So that's young gun number four. Hoping Greg Pattern's base card is sitting somewhere in here. Cody CC, what are you doing here? Another retro, it looks like. CC, McGinn, Lafferty, Pissick, and a Patrick Kane. Retro, Merrill, Lewis, and Vushnevich. You also get to see guys on like jersey, uh, different jerseys after they get traded. So like you saw the big name there, um, staring at a, a pile that has a pious suitor. This is a thick card. I think this is like the SPX Finite. Uh, Belmar, Goudreau, Tuck, and it certainly is. It's coal cylinder, numbered out of 2999. These are interesting. <laughs> that will be my commentary. They're interesting. Parise Hedman Riddich. Do I like it better or worse than last year? Such high numbering. Why bother numbering it at $29.99, honestly? It's kind 
of silly, but. All right, another shiny, which no idea. Fallmark, Benino, Halak. Oh yes, Holographics, Alexander Holtz. These are better than last year. Last year had this like, had this look to them that made them look dirty. So I'm gonna give this one a thumbs up. It looks a lot better. Jones, Fogel, Kemper, and Logan Stanley. And the dot design is interesting. I don't know. That wouldn't have been my choice to bring back, honestly. Uh, this is going to be a retro. Cole, Stepan. Oh, this is probably going to be our young gun, actually. Weinberg, Hyman. And it's Hendrix Lapierre. But see, look at, look at how boring and bland that design is. Ugh. Uh, Hockenpah, Bear, and Dobson. So what else are we looking for here? I think just a bunch of, or one, two, three, four, so two more young guns in five packs. One more young gun in four packs. Or two more because one of those is a friend. Mm -hmm. You know that's what we're hoping. Shiny. Probably holographics again. Chase on. Alice. Shayan. And it is. It's a Reflections of Carter Hart. This is a pretty decent set. I, I kind of like it. I like the look of that. Extended Love Shiny. Uh, Milano, Krebs, Grubauer, and Thompson. So three more. With any luck, two of these will be young guns. But we shall see. It doesn't look like it, but that is a holographics. All right. O'Connor, McDavid, Roy, Trennan, and holographics of Tre Trevor Zegris. That's a good name if you can get it. Marner, Goligoski, and Tana. Two more packs to go. Still looking for one young gun for sure. We got another black diamond, it looks like. Uh, Dunn, Eichel, Lundestrom, Vasilevsky, and a Kale McCarr double diamond. Suter, Everle, and Houghton. And the final pack. My math is bad. Yeah, well, this is definitely a young gun, so I guess we'll just go for it. Uh, one, two, three. Okay. So, Brian Elliott, Cal Clutterbuck, Seth Jones, and the team is the next one, Thomas Nosek. And the team is the Golden Knights. No idea. Daniel Miramanov. All right. Bunting with the Leafs, Zadorov, Corel. All right, next young gun. Looking at a couple cards in. Dowd, Reimer, Bastion, and the team is Colorado. Nope, no, no. Justus Ananen. That's a pretty decent one. He's a good prospect. Also, very zoomed in photo. Interesting. Uh, Lad, Matheson, Bozak, and Bozon. Continuing forwards, knocking the camera. All right, Yarn Crook, McMichael, McCann, Austin Matthews, and the team is San Jose, Ryan Merkley. That's a good name. Half decent name for sure. Forsberg, Glenn Denning, Richardson. Sammy Blay, Ryan Dezingo, Sam Reinhardt, and the team, the Kings, so Turcotte, hey Turcotte, that's probably second best one in there, behind Seth Jarvis, very nice, Blackwell, Nadelkovic, Hoffman, Bluger, next young gun, alright, we got Svechnikov, McDermott, Keith, and the team, the Senators, Igor Sokolov. Gotta be honest, I haven't heard of him. Uh, Donato, Garland, Middleton, and Craig Anderson. All right, final young gun of the box. Holtby, 
Ristoline and Perot. Kenny Jens. Uh, I don't remember his name, but yes, that guy. Michael Pozzetta. I believe he's the only have in there. Flurry, D'Angelo, Forsling, Forsling, and Eriks. All right, let's do this one next. This is, I believe, the canvas. It's very red. Uh, let's find out. All right, Suter, Hill, Dougie, Nick Holden. And it is a Brandon Duhame canvas young gun. All right. Barkley Goodrow, Arthur Callier, and Jake McCabe. And finally, the clear cut. So, three. All right, let's. It's been a while since I pulled the clear cut young gun, and it was from Extended last year, the only clear cut young gun that I pulled. Finestrosa. Hey, there he is. Last pack, PC, Jim EDC, Freddie Anderson. And it's sideways. It is a Nikita Zadorov clear cut. Well, there have certainly been better players, but we got Nikita Zadorov clear cut. Got Richie, Bouchard, and Larson. So, a recap, I guess. I feel like I missed something in there, but let's let's check this out. All right. So, young guns. We've got the Duhame canvas. We got Pozzetta, Sokolov, Turcot, Merkley, Anonen. Miramanov and the Retro of Lapierre. We got three Black Diamond. Makar Double, Kucherov, and Podkolzin. We got the regular canvases. We got the SBX of Makar. We got the clear cut of Nikita Zadorov. Yeah, all in all, it was interesting. I don't know. I don't know what to think. You're going to see me here just like flipping through. Uh, I'll flip through these later and see, but I think there was probably a French base that I missed. Uh, anyway, I, I think I'm going to do one more box of this for sure, but uh, check it out next time. Uh, until then, like, share, comment, subscribe, do all the YouTube things, and we'll see you next time.